this tutorial, I'm going to teach you how to fix this annoying problem. You probably see this after you done the update for your Mac, and um, you get this just all the time, whether or not you do the update or not. Um, so Java, you need to run it, okay? It's something for web pages, so whether you use Java or not, or whether you think you use it or not, you need to update it, okay? Because no matter if you're just looking at web pages, that's using JavaScript, okay? So you need to update this for sure. So you probably already done the more info and that doesn't work. Because you go to more info, you update whatever it tells you to, it doesn't work. So I'm gonna give you the exact link that you need to go to. And this is it. So you can, you can see the link right here below in the description. So just click on it and it'll drag you here, okay? Whether you get this in English or Spanish, same thing. Right here you can say that it says um, idiomas, which means languages, it says English, but yeah, it's giving me this stuff in Spanish. Uh, descargar, it just means download, so just click on download. And then once you click on download, okay, just install it. And once you restart your computer, it's gonna work again. So, once again, once you download it, it looks something like this. Okay, you click on the package. Okay, and you click continue, license, just agree. You do all your regular stuff and uh, just go through it, continue, make sure to, you know, set it up like any other program or on your iMac HDD or your MacBook Pro HDD. Um, this is the same thing if you have a Mac Mini, for example. Make sure if you have a password to put it in, obviously, in order to install. Um, once you have it downloaded and installed, the problem's not gonna go away just like that. You have to restart your computer. So after it's done doing this, that should take no more than two minutes. It actually takes about one minute actually, um, depending depending how many programs you're running at the same time, obviously, on your computer. So once you're doing that, um, just just go to your Mac and then press restart on it, and that's about it. Okay, uh, once you restart, you're gonna see that you will no longer get that annoying window saying that you need to update your JavaScript. Okay, so that's about it for this um, tutorial right now. If you guys have any questions, comments, please write them here below, and don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.